eats the boxing Pete life joined by heavyweight Matty Harris, who look, is looking to go 2-0 on Saturday night in Newcastle. Matty, the first, the first time I've never, um, I've had someone too tall about to ask them to slouch down before. To you didn't realise you, didn't realise you were that tall. Knew you were heavyweight, but so six foot eight you are. Uh, yeah, well, to be fair, I'm however tall I'm uh, close as I am. Um, I think we're about six seven, six eight, okay. maybe twitching six nine. <laughs> very, very, very tall indeed. So on Saturday night, um, looking to go, looking to go two and zero. Oh, how, how are you feeling about this fight compared to how you were feeling? Were you feeling nervous then? You feeling nervous now? I don't really get nervous before a fight. Um, this is it's completely different to the amateurs because this is just business to me. Mm -hmm. uh, I said I'm not nervous. The most nerves I get is actually before I get here, before I travel down for the fight week. That's when I get a little bit nervous. And then, apart from that, I might get. Um, I'll, I, you get them before you fight, but nothing that's gonna hinder me in any sort of way. Um, I said this time I'm looking to go in there and put an emphatic performance. This is a new territory for me. I've never been to Newcastle before, so uh, looking to give the people something to remember. Brilliant, good stuff. I just wanted to ask thoughts in the press conference. For anyone that doesn't know where St James's Park and with Newcastle United, um, you were kind of asked to speak there. I'm sure you've done lots of interviews today. Have you enjoyed today? Do you enjoy speaking to people like me or, or not so much? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of question is that? <laughs> nah, of course I, um, I do enjoy it, but it's, as I said, it's a it's all of a, a completely new experience. I'm just taking it in at the minute. It's crazy to me. As I said, I'm working graveyard shifts and warehouses to, to, to come to things like this. So it's insane. I'm loving it. Um, I appreciate every moment. As I said, I, I, I make sure that I enjoy every moment because I'm not sure when it's going to be my last. So yeah, obviously, we're here to work to make sure I don't, but you never know what can happen. So I make sure that I enjoy every day. So like this. Really good stuff, and I know you're not going to give too much away, but just in a nutshell, for people who haven't seen you fight before, what what, what, sort, what sort of fighter are you? How big a punch are you? What, what, what can they expect to see on Saturday? Um, I think a lot of the heavyweights out there know that I can hit. Uh, I've done, I had a, a bit of a reputation for being able to punch and sparring, but sparring, sparring, and then ten outs close. Like I said. I, I wasn't on my debut, honestly. I wasn't. I, I, I wasn't able to get him out of there this time. And I said I'll, I'll be going for it, but if it comes, it comes. If it does, I'm not stressed. I'm only 22. I'm in no rush um, to, to be pushing on for stuff. So, as I said, as on when it comes, I still need to get the rounds. Yeah, I didn't have a long amateur career, so getting the, the rounds in for me is very important. Um, but yeah, of course, I, I want to put on a good performance just to, for myself, really. <laughs> I do it my family for us. So, yeah. Brilliant, good stuff on mate. Thanks for giving me a bit of your time this afternoon. We'll see you tomorrow at the way and then we'll see you on Saturday for five night. Cheers mate. No worries, mate, appreciate it.